Oh my gosh, what have we found? It's a giant pirate squid. Yarktopus. You seem chill. What is going on, geeks? Unite the Clans here, back in your life with another episode of Don't Starve Shipwreck, coming to you from my ginormous, unfertilized berry farm. We're playing this time as Walani. This is the third episode in our Walani run, and uh, the 11th overall in the series. Um, I thought seriously about taking a break after episode 8 when everything went wrong with Woody, and I'm glad I'm back. We're having a decent run. I mean, my surfboard's fallen slightly apart, but it's the beginning of day six. We got some jaunty seafaring music. And while we have flower petals hopefully turning into fertilizer back at this base and a winter's supply of sweet potatoes to eat, we now head south. We head south in search of another island, an island that may contain more gold. The alchemy engine is on our... T Ooh, we got some shoals. Here's another potential fishing spot along with the mangrove swamp if we can find a... Uh... You know what? You know what? Maybe we need some limestone armor. I guess we got log suit. No, we'll leave all this for now. We don't need to be... Way to distract yourself, UTC. Don't go taking a pick to coral unless you get a specific plan. Holy crap, that's a giant squid. Holy crap, that's a pirate squid. Oh my gosh, what have we found? It's a giant pirate squid. Yarktopus. You seem chill. Is that seriously it? Give. Hey, get away from me, you damn jellyfish fool. Give, give, give. What can I give him? No. No, he no like that. You like uncooked seeds? Yeah. What about uncooked seaweed? <laughs> this is not gonna work. He won't even, I, can't, I don't even have the option to give him one. Man, that's cool. I'm gonna have to Google. I'm gonna have to Google Yarktopus and see what it is all about. I obviously get the reference. He's a peg-legged pirate. That's not some weird little nipple on the end of that thing. If you see that, that is a peg leg. He is a clearly a pirate creature. I'm gonna have to get this boat home. This ain't not gonna make it. That's all right. There's an island out here, and man, we have found a cool character. Hit me up in those comments. Tell me what the hell a yarktopus is. Yarktopus, I guess is how it would be properly be pronounced. Oh, we found another mangrove. Is this one dense with fish? It is. Is there a jungle full of gold nearby? Please tell me there is. It's a big old mangrove. This is huge. Sand. We got beach? We've got beach. I should have brought some boards. I'm not going to be able to get home. This raft's going to break. Okay, we got to go make a crappy raft on this island. With... I need twigs. Twigs are what I need. And we'll be digging them up as long as we possibly can. So that we can replant them back at the base. That's the game plan. Is get a twig farm going alongside the berry farm. Twigs do not need to be uh, fertilized, as far as I know. Is this a new island? I thought it was a new island. I hope it's a new... Yes, it is a new island. I believe. It is. Good. Okay, cool. We are underway. We are underway yet again. I think this is going to be another good run. I'm stoked for it. We... Our record is what... I shouldn't start talking about records. It's too early to talk about records. You're having fun, you got a good run going UTC, just shut your damn mouth and don't go blabbing about your all-time record, idiot. What a moron. I almost jinxed myself. I'm not much of a superstitious one, but, I mean, let's be honest, it would be a bad idea to start talking about how far I've ever made it in this game on day six, when I know just about every single run has been longer than this one. Almost every single run. I think there was a really bad, like, two, three-day run in there somewhere. Who knows? Oh, dig. Dig, dig. Idiot. What are you doing? Take these with you. We gotta get these going. Let's get some crab meat. Oh, no. It's sand. Uh, hammer this. Yes, we got these. Okay, cool. Maybe we can actually make a new surfboard while we're here. What is it? One thing and two seashells. Oh, of course we can. New, new surfboard. Done. Cool. We're stoked for that. We're set up with that. We don't have to mess around too much. Dig. Dig it. You only got one dig left in you before your shovel breaks. Can I make a new shovel out here? Yes, I can. Who needs a science machine? This, you know what? This is a good little beach that we found. This is giving us just about every dang thing we need right now. Oh, I just got to make it back before night. Okay, should we call it here? Should I leave? Or should we stay? We should stay. I should set up a... Yeah, let's quickly chop down some trees. Uh, axe? I don't 
have an axe. Can I make an axe? There we go. I bet I have an axe somewhere. We'll just get some wood so we can make a little overnight fire and then maybe, maybe a torch. Yeah, a torch is what we actually want. And we'll just make sure that this island doesn't have the gold on it that we're looking for. It's still early. What am I freaking out about? Tell me this is the kind of forest that is full of gold. The kind of jungle, the kind of monkey filled crap. That's a poison snake. We've we been poisoned to death in this series yet. If not, it's coming. It's coming eventually. Yes, golden boulder. Okay. This is dangerous setting up out here. Because if you get a snake attack at night, ooh, danger. Big danger. Uh, but we get a golden boulder. Uh, I'm going to have to clear up some of this inventory. I guarantee that. Sorry, guys. I'm shutting right the heck, right the heck up. There we go. We gotta feed ourselves, and I'm too distracted to talk to you and make sure I don't die at the same time, which I guess is the whole purpose of this series. Golden nugget, exactly what we wanted. Two, two golden nuggets. Okay, we just need one more of those magnificent boulders. Oh, bad timing. Bad, bad timing. Let's see if I can make a torch. Maybe we'll burn down some of this jungle. Because that's not the only way to get charcoal, or whatever it's called, which you need for um, the drying rack and the crock pot. You need this for many things. So burning down a large swath of jungle not only keeps the snakes away, but it supplies you with an excellent needed resource. Anything little that burns, though, just gives you ash. Which, I mean, that whole forest is going to go up in flames. It has to. Yeah, there we go. I'm surprised more of it didn't go up. We'll take what we can get. Take what we can get. Get a... Yeah, this is a... I mean, this is a tough game. This ain't easy. And I might be hitting the point. I gotta be honest, guys. This is the third episode I've recorded in a single sitting. Sort of doing the opposite of what I talked about in recent episodes. I'm recording this in a batch. And there, there comes a point when you're recording batch recordings. And in my mind, it's around the one hour mark where I suddenly become a lot less charismatic. I suddenly get a lot worse at talking, and uh, I have trouble just finding words. And that point may be coming, and it may be coming quickly, because uh, honestly, I'm starting to feel it now. I'm starting to feel, oh, you've been, you've been recording too long. Your brain ain't working no more. Oh, yes, I love that song. That song gets me hyped up for this game. It lets me know that everything's going to be okay. Every little thing. Gonna be ari. You got nothing to worry about when you're hearing that song. We'll just grab the last of this charcoal, and man, did I burn down more forest than I needed to. And tell me there's a golden boulder right beside my fire. Tell me there is. Yes. You see that? I see it. I see it through the trees. I got eagle-eyed vision. Come on. Get... Yes. Tell me 9%'s enough. No, it's not enough. Okay. Crap. Now I gotta drop something. Uh, tell me I have the resources. There we go. Those twigs? Am I holding on to those twigs? Or are we out of twigs again already? We're probably out of twigs any second. There. One more nugget. I need... Ugh. Dang it. We need one more nugget, I think, for alchemy engine. So another boulder is required. That's alright. It's here. It's on this island. We're not gonna get... Yes. I knew it. I knew we weren't gonna get screwed. Alright, we are geared up. We got everything we need, I think. I'm feeling good. Okay. Let us... Perfect timing, perfect timing for my mid-episode break. Geeks, I'm going to be back with you in one second. Go watch a commercial. It makes me a few pennies, especially if you watch for longer than 30 seconds. So, thank you. No, seriously, don't watch them if you don't have to. If you're distracted, if you're lying in bed and you can't reach your laptop, then definitely watch it because you might make me a penny or two. I'm just messing around. I will be back with you guys in just a minute. Welcome back, geeks. How you doing? This is the mangrove swamp on our base, and I think it is not as rich in fish as I was hoping. It actually looks fairly quiet. You'd be able to see their little silhouettes swimming around here, but we are back. Tell me we got some rot. Tell me those... Yes, we have a little bit of rot. We're going to be able to get this berry farm... Oh, we're going to be able to get this berry farm off the ground. But before we do, let's build ourselves that alchemy engine. You need... 
electrical doodads. For which I need cut stone. Hopefully I've got enough stuff here. Cut stone. Uh, yes. I'll make room in my inventory. Oh, I haven't started talking yet. When did I start talking again? Damn it! Hold on. How am I going to time this episode if I never remember when I restart things? Okay. <laughs> Sounds good to me. Uh, clicking back on a the game. There we go. Thanks for waiting for me there, geeks. Uh, dropping the empty bottle. Picking up the cut stone. And we'll make one more cut stone, I think. And we'll make two, hopefully, electrical doodads. Doodad me. What do I need still? Oh, science machine. Getting closer to it. There we go. I knew I had the basics covered. There's my doodads. And we need two more cut stone and three planks. Well, we got a load of planks right here. Just waiting to be used. And I see if I can make more cut stone. I don't think I can make a whole lot more. I can make one more. Okay, well, I'll go grab us some more rocks to make cut stone with. And I'll come back to you guys in yet another second. Eee, that is getting dark. It's fine. My sanity can handle it. Isn't there another log up here? Okay, that's fine. That's fine. We'll keep the fire going. Oh, let's grab this rot. Let's grab all this rot. How much I have? I have eight. Okay, eight will get us started. Fertilize. Fertilize. Guys, we are, we are underway. This is a farm that is now thriving. I don't know how it's po not thriving. This is a farm that is now, it's a fledgling farm. It is beginning to take off. Pretty soon we'll have another 20 odd rot right there. That'll help us fertilize more. And look what I have in my inventory. A bunch of sticks too. And we'll keep planting these. And we're, you know what? I'm feeling good about this. This is arguably the best run I have put together. I don't know which one is the best of the crappy ones that I've done a bunch of. Uh, I don't know. I don't know which ones are actually good. But uh, this feels about as good as they have gotten. I'm here as Wolani. we got a few minutes left in this episode. The thing that we are attempting to accomplish science machine and to do that I need more stone I couldn't do it the night fell on me very very quickly but we'll see what we can do we'll see what we can do over on this side of the island the old jungle side the scary snake infested side this is like the ugly cousin of our side of the island I, I wonder if I use this thing hammer can I smash with a hammer no I can't smash malfunctioning novelty ride will have to stay tell me there's a there's a boulder I can bust apart though tell me there's a damn boulder somewhere on this island there's one up top that I'd I chopped into ever so slightly I started breaking apart that might be the only thing there might not be a whole lot of stone around here there's a little bit there's a little bit that's the one I, I just broke it up and then the snakes chased me off and I couldn't finish I need more I think I need more if I'm gonna do this yeah yeah that's it sadly okay well uh then I guess I gotta go get my surfboard and set off for another island. Dang it. How are we gonna finish this stupid? Let's make sure. Let's have a quick look and make sure that I can't make enough cut stone to make this thing. So we need one more cut. Oh, I, I do have it, I think. Tell me. Yes, alchemy engine. Okay, we did it. Perfect timing. Perfect frickin' timing. All right, cool. Alchemy engine underway. That lets us build a bunch more good stuff. And this place is starting to come together. We got sticks that we wouldn't have had. This island does not have enough sticks. It also, obviously, doesn't have berries. But we're slowly, slowly fertilizing and bringing to life this Garden of Eden that we've thrown together here. It's a good-looking spot. I like it here. And if things get tough, if I can't find food... I mean, look, I'm loaded up with it right now. We're loaded... Totally up with food right now. More than... Oh, speaking of, let's eat. Let's not starve. That is the point of this game. Lord, imagine if I just starved to death not paying attention. We'll eat all these freaking berries. Uh, and then I think we're coming up to the end of yet another episode of Don't Starve Ship, are we? No, let's keep going. This is nonsense. I ain't ending this thing until it's over. I feel like we haven't done enough. We have not done a dang enough. It's too easy. Life's too good for old UTC right now. Alright, cool. 
Now, what what is awaiting us out here in this wilderness? Is there... Where are the other islands? We know there's one this way. Let's just hop on our surfboard. Let's just hop on a surfboard, and we'll head out there. The day is young. There's not much we can do around here. There's not much I want to do around here, and we'll have to go get ourselves some more resources anyway. So we'll see. Maybe we can end this episode with the discovery of a new land mass. Perhaps, perhaps a magical one filled with great resources and everything we'll ever need. <laughs> uh, I do like this, though. I, uh, I, like, I like being able to surf instead of rowing a boat. Hands-free, you know? Faster. Easy to construct once you get the science machine. And what I think is that there's land in this direction, eastward. And I'll tell you why I think it. Look at this. Look at how, look at this little pocket of dark that we're in on the map right there. See that pocket of dark? It gets light again over here. And then right down here, it starts to get even lighter. So, straight across, and at some point, we'll make a turn south. I'm heading ever so slightly south as we head east. Oh, oh, look. New lands above and below. Below first. This is where we look. Tell me we got a magical, mystical place here. Yeah, this looks good to me. Oh yes, jungle. Yes. Okay, well we got more jungle. We probably got more rocks and more gold here. We'll see if what we find as we go around the coast. If this is just jungle, I don't have a whole lot of interest. If we, because what we, you know, if we need uh, t whatever vines or bamboo or jungle wood or anything, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool. If we need any of those things, we can get them. It's not that hard, but more gold. I ain't got none of that on my island, and I ain't got no rocks either. So we're gonna see what we can grab, and what if we found just a little jungle island? I think that's all it is. I'm cool with that. Hopefully no monkeys. Monkeys suck. They're no good. I don't know, if you guys have mastered living next to monkeys in your worlds, you, you give me the, give me the skinny, give me the how-to, because I ain't got it figured out. I just, they drive me nuts, like crazier, 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 until I smack one in the head, and then it's an all-out war. Or I accidentally smack one in the head, or I accidentally smack a pig in the face. It's, I mean, I haven't had the best luck when it comes to animal friends so far in the, the wilderness of Don't Starve Shipwrecked. Uh, I'm trying to remember how many runs we've done. We started as Wilson, right? Started as Wilson, made it about a week, I think. Then Tom Hanks. Tom Hanks also died. I forget how. Tom Hanks chopped his friend, Librius, that's right, in the face. I think with an axe? Um, I don't know. It's, it's been, it's, it's been a, a lot of bad with, with all the good. There's been, like I said, this is, so then after Tom Hanks, we did Woody. So this is run number four, episode number 12, I believe. I'm recording a little bit in advance, so it's hard for me to keep track, but I, I believe, episode 11 maybe, I can't remember what we're on, it doesn't matter. Anyway, you're already watching it, and you're already almost at the end of this damn thing. Oh, we're gonna need to build another fire here. That's cool, no problem. No problem at all. Uh, I might as well, let's just see if I can get a torch going. And I just don't want to tango with snakes tonight, especially poisonous ones, so we're just gonna see if we can find like a non-jungle biome to set up camp in. And I have the resources for a fire, no I don't. I don't have the resources for a fire in the least. So, um, drop this and make another torch real quick, just so that we don't die tonight. There we go. We're torched up, and we're gonna stay mobile for this evening. Um, guys, I think that's gonna do it. I'd like to let you know that I've gotten to a safe location, so maybe this episode runs a few minutes longer. Uh, no, look at all this gold. I'm gonna have to mine all this, so we ain't going anywhere anytime soon. We're stuck on this jungle island, but it's a monkeyless jungle island. And it could be a future site of expansion. In the morning, I'm going to mine all this gold. Uh, but geeks, that's going to do it for this one. Thank you so much for checking it out. And I will see you all in the next episode of Don't Starve Shipwrecked. Fallout 4, episode 21. Me and Kate here at the Railroad's hideout. <laughs>